and be put in just horrible situation. Yeah, I mean, uh, Sin versus Sin versus Venom is definitely one of those uh, those matchups that looks in the favor of the character who's winning, because it's either a dominating zoning performance from Venom or just an absolute rushdown from Sin. So this is uh, loser semifinals. The winner of this will go on to face the loser of the, the double L felt dream team of uh, Oso <laughs> and Nerd Josh. Yeah. Yes. So um, this will be the uh, the last non L felt character you'll see for the entire rest of the tournament. That's right. <laughs> Sorry. Well, I hope uh, to all the L felt fans out here. Uh, well, I guess you're getting your wish. Uh, I don't know if anyone's ever wished for that, Joe. <laughs> there's a lot of people out there. And I'm sure there's at least one. <laughs> Totally, man. So we have a Dallas versus Houston matchup yet again. Uh, faulty defense versus Sunfish. Venom versus Sinkiski. And here we go. Right into it. Ooh, he picked Sin's theme. I like this one. Yeah, the music in this game is incredible. All right, faulty defense immediately with the throw. Could it okay, oh, oh and drops a combo because it hits anti air and gets put in the corner. Those kind of things can be very unfortunate. Oh, nice oh, burst keeping in the corner. You're seeing that burst sin, you just need to burst early combos and keep your momentum going. You cannot let him get a full combo on you. Although, yeah, this neutral situation might be a little tricky. Once he gets the balls out, it gets a lot Ooh. better, but faulty defense is doing an incredibly good job weaving in and not letting that happen. Yeah. And this is going to be a big combo. Oh, wow. And you're probably going to see another super Oki okay setup. And this is going to be an instant overhead, a low. Instant oh, no. overhead gets blocked. He's, he's electing to go in. He's got plenty of hunger meter. He can just Jeez. do whatever he wants. There he goes. The beauty of that setup is he can block the instant overhead. He gets mixed up again. He can block that mix-up. He still has a jump cancel. And then he can go for one more. So there's three mix-ups going on at least there. And as you saw, a <laughs> third one hit and killed him. Oh, nice throw by the Sunfish. Playing around throws is one of the biggest part of Guilty Gears. Being good at it and baiting it is like totally what separates a good player from a bad player in this game. Yeah, I've heard it said that uh, this game definitely revolves around getting around those throws just because they're so strong, they deal with so much. <laughs> you saw him YRC and get, oh, and oh. the bait! Very nice, gives him back all his food meter. And no burst left. Any big combo starter here is gonna totally kill. Yeah, this is oh, but Tex threw the slam. Oh, the, the, the carcass ray trades. You may see a super come out from Sin soon. Yeah, he's sitting on a lot of meter, and there it is. <laughs> that he's super is easily one of the best supers in the game. It does so oh, much yes. block stun, it's pretty safe, and it just totally dominates the pace. Yeah, both of Sin's supers are very good. Oh yeah, as the, the Ride the Lightning Redux, which is a extremely quick, airborne-enabled uh, reversal super that can lead into a combo. He's got his Fireball super that can either be used in the air to extend combos or on the ground to start mix-up. He's He's definitely a character with a lot of options for his meter. Here we go, game two. Sunfish definitely has to make some smart decisions in order to keep himself alive in this one. Very nice, keeps him in the corner, and that does a nearly soft knockdown. There is very occasionally a time where it won't knock them down, but it's really rare. So his his air combo game is incredible. Oh man, that as you see there. yet again. Oh, now the Oki set up off of this. Is going, oh, okay. Sunfish smartly uh, just defended the last hit of that to get himself out of the uh, the incoming mix-up. Oh, very nice poke. Oh, man. Faulty defense looking very good. All this meter he's got. Sunfish is finally starting to contest a little more. Oh, and this might just uh, go through and punish him. Yes. yes. Wow. So fast. Anime wow. games are unlike a lot of other fighting games in that counter hits will even register during the recovery of a lot of moves. So what you saw there is he popped through and countered him on the recovery, which is a huge amount of damage. So here we go Sunfish trying to keep things going his way. But like, you know, there it is. God, that, that, one, that one hit leads into he, so much, and he's lost over half his life already. Yeah, Venom, another lowish health character. And if he can't, this is going to be another big combo. Oh, this won't quite man. kill, but it'll lead into the Oki setup that will. All right, he's stingering YRCs to get something going. Oh, misses oh, the misses ball. The, oh, that's big. Gets crouched under and misses the ball, totally oh, ruining his OK though. setup. Here we go. And yet again, he misses the ball, misses Sin straight up. I think he's starting to crack a little under the pressure. Sin with both characters with a burst. Very smart YRC, but gets jumped back on. Oh, wow, the 6P gets stuffed. Ride the oh, lightning. Probably can be safe. The oh, cross up, and faulty defense takes it. 
that's a mix-up in that situation. He can stop it early and just go that way. He can come back. I mean, it reminds me of uh, Nova, Super, and Marvel. There's a ton of those. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a uh, uh, Beast Cannon, uh, Galon from Vampire yes, Savior. <laughs> yes, he can choose the direction for three consecutive attacks, which makes it really hard to punish and really good for uh, kind of ghetto mix-up. All right, and we're going to...